thanks so much for making time. Um, looking forward to getting to know you a little bit better and chatting about the great work that you're doing here at Amazon. Heather, you have the incredible responsibility in overseeing the health and safety of all of the workers in our company. And I'm sure when you joined Amazon 15 months ago, you probably could have never described what your job would look like today. Um, what do your days look like these days? Certainly at the beginning of the pandemic, uh, my days changed. Um, and I don't know that we recognized right away how much they would change. I think there was still this hope at the beginning that it would be something that we could, um, we could continue to do our regular day jobs and have uh, a team of people really be dedicated to our, our COVID management and response. So that was our, our initial sort of plan, but that did not last very long. It became apparent very quickly that all of my team, and in fact, all of worldwide operations became very focused on COVID and what that meant for keeping our workforce safe. Was it a little intimidating um, coming up with all of those process changes? It hasn't just been the workplace health and safety team. Initially, at the beginning, uh, the, the senior leadership team was meeting every day for an hour. And we would come together in those meetings, and everybody would come with passion and ideas um, at, in terms of what we could be doing. So we came up with many ideas that were um, originated from teams outside of workplace health and safety, because this is something where it was literally all hands on deck and everybody was super focused and really wanted to play a part in, in our response. Can you give us a sense of scale and reach of what you have to address every day in terms of considering and implementing new policies and how many people that affects? We we're one of the first to mandate masks for all of our associates and, and the scale that that's required to provide those to associates every day for day after day. So that was one. And then another example was just when we decided very early on that we were going to start temperature screening all our people as they came into our building. So initially it was how quickly can we get handheld thermometers, um, touchless handheld thermometers. So we very quickly procured those and uh, deployed them out to all of the sites. But from there, we pivoted to um, thermal cameras. It's just a, a huge effort that requires many teams to come together to scale that at the level that you need to at Amazon. So our engineering teams in the matter of 36 hours came up with a number of different designs that they developed and then manufactured themselves and very quickly deployed that out across our worldwide operations within a matter of days. Wondering how large is the team you manage? I'm sure it's grown since January, right? Yeah, you know, I think when I first joined uh, back in 2019, we had a team of about 2,500 health and safety professionals. And uh, health and safety, even before the pandemic, was a number one priority. We very quickly scaled to over 3,500. And at times, at the peak, uh, we had over 5,000 if you include all of the different experts and contractors that we were also relying upon for our COVID response. Now wondering what steps is Amazon taking that make you sleep better at night? Well, I think that if you go into any one of our buildings today versus before the pandemic, they look very different. Now we clean across the site um, eight times a shift and, and we have you know, given our associates lots of cleaning supplies so that they can clean and put in hand sanitizer stations and all of those things so that people can and can keep themselves safe. So those are the kinds of things that I think make people feel safe in coming to work. And, and it's so important. Like I, I understand uh, we're in trying times and stressful times. And I, I, we all want people to recognize that safety is truly uh, a top priority and that they, they recognize that when they're in one of our facilities. What are some of the innovative measures that your team has come up with that you're most proud of? So there's one that's called the distance assistant and it is a monitor that's placed in, in areas that's um, got some high traffic. So they can see themselves on the screen. 
and uh, the monitor will show a green circle around you if you are six feet from anybody else and then it'll turn red when you are less than six feet even though that contact may be for just a brief moment of time um, we still think that it's important to remind people to keep that six feet social distance and in fact that one in particular it's something that we've made available publicly so we've had other companies that have reached out to us and and asked how they could utilize um, that type of tool in their own workplaces what has been your favorite thing about working at Amazon the people, for sure, at Amazon, just, you know, the bright minds that are here and, and how you utilize uh, that talent is something that's really special about Amazon. Heather, th thank you again so much for chatting today. Thank you so much for all of the work that you and your team are doing to keep us safe here at Amazon. Really appreciate it. Well, thank you. It was a pleasure to be here and talk with you today and uh, be part of my first career day at Amazon.